cyclocanes are types of hydrocarbon compounds that have one or more rings of carbon atoms in the chemical structure of their molecules. Alkanes are types of organic hydrocarbon compounds that have only single chemical bonds in their chemical structure. Cyclocanes consist of only carbon and hydrogen atoms and are saturated because there are no multiple C-C bonds to hydrogenate. A general chemical formula for pyrocyclocanes would be CnH2, N plus 1 G, where N equals number of C atoms and G equals number of rings in the molecule. For those cyclocanes that have one ring in their molecules, cyclocanes can be treated as isomers of their alkane counterparts, for example, cyclopropane and propane both have the chemical formula C3H6. Cyclocanes with a single ring are named analogously to their normal arcan counterpart of the same carbon count, cyclopropane, cyclobotane, cyclopentane, cyclohexane, etc. The larger cyclocanes, with greater than 20 carbon atoms are typically called cyclopropanes. Cyclocanes are classified into small, common, medium, and large cyclocanes, where cyclopropane and cyclobotane are the small ones, cyclopentane, cyclohexane, cyclorheptane are the common ones, cycloctane through cyclotridocane are the medium ones, and the rest are the larger ones. Nomenclature, see also, IUPAC nomenclature. The naming of polycyclic alkanes such as bicyclic alkanes and spiroalkanes is more complex, with the base name indicating the number of carbons in the ring system, a prefix indicating the number of rings, and a numeric prefix before that indicating the number of carbons in each part of each ring, exclusive of junctions. For instance, a bicycloctane that consists of a six-member ring and a four-member ring, which share two adjacent carbon atoms that form a shared edge, is 4.2.0, bicycloctane. That part of the six-member ring, exclusive of the shared edge has four carbons. That part of the four-member ring, exclusive of the shared edge, has two carbons. The edge itself, exclusive of the two vertices that define it, has zero carbons. There is more than one convention for the naming of compounds, which can be confusing for those who are just learning, and inconvenient for those who are well rehearsed in the older ways. For beginners it is best to learn IUPAC nomenclature from a source that is up to date, because this system is constantly being revised. In the above example, 4.2.0, Bicycloctane would be written bicyclo, 4.2.0, octane to fit the conventions for IUPAC naming. It has then got room for an additional numerical prefix if there is the need to include details of other attachments to the molecule such as chlorine or a methyl group. Another convention for the naming of compounds is the common name, which is a shorter name and it gives less information about the compound. An example of a common name is terpeniol the name of which can tell us only that it is an alcohol and it should then have a hydroxide group attached to it. An example of the IUPAC method is given in the image to the right. In this example the base name is listed first, which indicates the total number of carbons in both rings including the carbons making up the shared edge. Then in front of the base name is the numerical prefix, which lists the number of carbons in each ring, excluding the carbons that are shared by each ring plus the number of carbons on the bridge between the rings. In this case there are two rings with two carbons each and a single bridge with one carbon, excluding the carbons shared by it and the other two rings. There is a total of three numbers and they are listed in descending order separated by dots, thus, 2.2.1. Before the numerical prefix is another prefix indicating the number of rings. Thus, the name is bicyclo, 2.2.1. Heptane. The group of cyclocanes are also known as naphthenes. Properties Cyclocanes are similar to alkanes in their general physical properties, but they have higher boiling points, melting points, and densities than alkanes. This is due to stronger London forces because the ring shape allows for a larger area of contact. Containing only CC and CH bonds, Unreactivity of cyclocanes with little or no ring strain are comparable to non cyclic alkanes. Ring strain The carbon atoms in cyclocanes are sp3 hybridized and are therefore a deviation from the ideal tetrahedral bond angles of 109A degree 28. This causes an increase in potential energy and an overall destabilizing effect. 
eclipsing of hydrogen atoms is an important destabilizing effect, as well. The strain energy of a cyclone can is the theoretical increase in energy caused by the compound's geometry, and is calculated by comparing the experimental standard enthalpy change of combustion of the cyclone can with a value calculated using average bond energies. Ring strain is highest for cyclopropane in which the carbon atoms form a triangle and therefore have 60 degrees Celsius cc bond angles. There are also three pairs of eclipsed hydrogens. The ring strain is calculated to be around 120 kJ per mole. Cyclobutane has the carbon atoms in a puckered square with approximately 90 degree bond angles. Puckering reduces the eclipsing interactions between hydrogen atoms. Its ring strain is therefore slightly less, at around 110 kJ per mole. For a theoretical planar cyclopentane the CCC bond angles would be 108 degrees, very close to the measure of the tetrahedral angle. Actual cyclopentane molecules are puckered, but this changes only the bond angle slightly so that angle strain is relatively small. The eclipsing interactions are also reduced, leaving a ring strain of about 25 kJ per mole. In cyclohexane the ring strain and eclipsing interactions are negligible because the puckering of the ring allows ideal tetrahedral bond angles to be achieved. As well, in the most stable chair form of cyclohexane, axial hydrogens on adjacent carbon atoms are pointed in opposite directions, virtually eliminating eclipsing strain. After cyclohexane, the molecules are unable to take a structure with no ring strain, resulting in an increase in strain energy which peaks at 9 carbons. After that, strain energy slowly decreases until 12 carbon atoms, where it drops significantly. At 14, another significant drop occurs and the strain is on a level comparable with 10 kJ per mole. After 14 carbon atoms, sources disagree on what happens to ring strain, some indicating that it increases steadily, others saying that it disappears entirely. However, Bond angle strain and eclipsing strain are an issue only for smaller rings. Reactions, the simple and the bigger cyclocanes are very stable, like alkanes, and their reactions, for example, radical chain reactions, are like alkanes. The small cyclocanes, in particular, cyclopropane, have a lower stability due to Bayer strain and ring strain. They react similarly to alkanes, though they do not react in electrophilic addition but in nucleophilic aliphatic substitution. These reactions are ring opening reactions or ring cleavage reactions of orchal cyclocanes. Cyclocanes can be formed in a Diels order reaction followed by a catalytic hydrogenation. See also, cyclocan, cyclopropane, cyclobutane, cyclopentane, cyclohexane, cycloheptane, cycloctane. References, IUPAC. Compendium of Chemical Terminology, 2nd ed. Online Corrected Version, Cycle Canes. Organic Chemistry IUPAC Nomenclature. Ruler 23. Hydrogenated Compounds from Fused Polycyclic Hydrocarbons HTTP, www.actlabs.com Nomenclatura 7973 HTM, Organic Chemistry IUPAC Nomenclature Ruler 31. Bridged Hydrocarbons, Bicyclic Systems HTTP, www.actlabs.com Nomenclatura 79163 HTM, Organic Chemistry IUPAC Nomenclature Rules of 41, of 42, Spirohydrocarbons HTTP, www.actlabs.com Nomenclatura 79196 HTM, Organic Chemistry IUPAC Nomenclature Rules of 51, of 52, of 53, of 54, Hydrocarbon Ring Assemblies HTTP, www.actlabs.com Nomenclatura 79158 HTM. External links, Cycle Canes at the Online Encyclopedia Britannica, Cycle Canes by the Chemistry Staff at Westminster College.